Hi and welcome to my workbench. Today on the workbench we've got a Wurlitzer amplifier. This is out of a 1400 Wurlitzer jukebox. That's the one with the twin tone arms. I um, haven't seen one of these amplifiers before. It came in for repair. Um, it's now all done. Um, so a little listen for the customer. Um, I notice it's got a free play adapter in there. Um, this supplies this amplifier is the power supply for the mech as well. These are not an output transformer and a mains transformer. There are two mains transformers. The output transformer is mounted under the chassis on this particular amplifier. It's obviously designed for the Cobra cartridge. So at the moment, just so the customer can hear the amplifier, I've got my iPod uh, connected into the grid of the, of the second valve um, after the um, oscillator for the uh, Cobra system. So we'll put it on for you. Bit of volume. Base control. Travel. Okay, I'll cut that because I'm seeming to get some strikes on my uh, videos lately. So, uh, yeah, just a quick listen of this uh, Wurlitzer 1400 amplifier. And what I'll do now, I'll stop the video and I will plug in an old car brew cartridge just so you can see that the Cobra system is working. Okay, so this is just to confirm that the Cobra circuit is working. I've checked all the components in the Cobra circuit and I've also tested the first oscillator valve here. So everything should work as it should do when it's back in the jukebox and just to prove that um, it is working, I can... Chris is going to blow my speaker up in that. Um, anyway, you can see it works. Um, let's turn this volume down a bit. Um, and with a decent Cobra cartridge, um, it should sound as it should. Okay, thanks a lot for watching. Oh, and it'll be shipped about um, probably Monday, Tuesday next week.